welcome back guys i hope all of you will be fine so this is question 4.20 and 4.21 of chapter 4 so let us first talk about question 4.20 okay so this is what this is question 4.20 and the statement of it is a continuous random variable x has the density function which is f of x exponential of minus x for x greater than 0 and 0 elsewhere okay so find the expected value of g of x equal to e of 2x by 3 okay so now let us first solve it okay and this is 4.20 and here in order to use the formula for finding the expected value we previously have seen that for a continuous random variable it would be what instead of x we have to write here g of x and we have to multiply it with f of x okay so let me first write the values here the value of f of x is exponential of minus e x for x greater than 0 and g of x is 2 x by 3 okay so let me write it here okay so e of x would be f of x is exponential of minus x and g of x is exponential of 2x by 3 so exponential of 2x by 3 and f of x is exponential of minus x dx okay and also let me put the limit for exponential of minus x and that is for x is greater than 0 so it would be from 0 to infinity okay let me solve it here again so it would be uh, what it would be 2x by 3 minus x dx okay 0 to infinity and also solving it and then finding it here i will get 0 to infinity exponential of 3x uh, 2x minus 3x divided by 3 would be minus x by 3 d of x okay and also integrating it what i will get here i will get exponential of minus x by 3 divided by minus 1 by 3 from 0 to infinity let me put the values of the limit and also here i will get minus 3 and here exponential of minus infinity minus exponential of 0 okay so ultimately we will get minus 3 uh, here 0 minus 1 so the answer of it will be 3 okay so that is what that is the solution of question 4.20 okay so we have solved it by using the formula which is here okay uh, similarly now let me move to question 4.21 okay and let me see that what is it asking us what is the dealer's average profit per automobile if the profit on each automobile is given by gx equal to x square where x is a random variable having the density function of exercise 4.20 4.12 okay so let me move to exercise 4.12 and see that how can we employ this formula there instead of x we have to write g of x so let me move to that exercise so here we can see that in exercise 4.12 uh, we had the statement that if a dealer's profit in units of five thousand dollars on a new automobile can be looked upon as a random variable x having the density function which is given here two one minus x for the x greater than zero and less than one find the average profit so here the density function was this one okay we have to use it here as well but instead of using the conventional function we have to find the expected value of x uh, for g of x f of x okay and d of x okay so now here as given in the statement of the uh, question the value of g of x is what it is here x square so let me put these values here and what i will get expected value of x would be here and a g of x would be x square and also the value of f of x is 2 into 1 minus x square d of x okay and also the limits for it are 0 to 1 okay let me solve it 
so here e of x would be what from 0 to 1 and multiplying it inside i will get 2x square minus 2x cube okay these two are multiplied together and then these are multiplied uh, to the 1 minus x square v and also here d of x okay uh, now let me integrate them separately okay so integrating them separately what i will get 0 to 1 2 x square of dx minus 0 to 1 2 x cube d of x okay uh, here we will get 2 x cube by 3 and 0 to 1 and also 2 x 4 divided by 4 0 to 1 okay let me put these values here these limits and i will get from here 2 by 3 and from here i will get 1 by 2 and ultimately solving it this will be 6 okay and uh, 4 minus 3 so it would be 1 by 6 okay so the average value is 1 by 6 also let me see that what are the unit values here so the unit values are 5000 okay so what do i have to do i have to find the expected value here so therefore i have to multiply the expected value with the unit value and that is 5000 okay so 5000 divided by 6 is how much let me calculate it this would be 833.34 okay so that is in usd so it will be the usd and that is what the answer of question 4.21 okay so that's it for today in which we have seen the solution of question 4.20 and 21 if you have any question you can ask me in the comment box see you soon